Hi, I'm Jamie Wall with the entertainment news for Monday. To begin with, here's our trivia quiz. In what 1974 film did Faye Dunaway play femme fatale to Jack Nicholson's private eye? Well, the Olympic Arts Festival is off and running, and if Saturday night's gala is any indication of the quality and professionalism of the festival, then we're in for five more weeks of exceptional entertainment. Approximately 10,000 well-heeled Calgarians attended the gala at the Saddle Dome. The Calgary Philharmonic were in fine form, as was the huge Olympic massed choir. Taller Cranston skated. Composer David Foster debuted his theme for the Winter Games. And Quebec comic André Philippe Gagnon brought the crowd to our feet with his wild impressions, including this one of Tom Jones. She Other notables at the gala were Oscar Peterson, Anne Murray, and the hard-rocking lover boy. Quite a contrast in styles. Last night, Canadian dance history was made when Canada's premier English and French dance companies shared the Jubilee stage. Montreal's Les Grands Ballets Canadiens performed the innovative The Rite of Spring. National Ballet of Canada countered with an important new work called La Ronde, which first debuted in November. The ballet was adapted from a controversial play about decaying morals in turn-of-the-century Vienna. You might call it dirty dancing classical style. It deals with ten people who uh, have affairs with each other. It has to deal. It deals with with um, love, but uh, in an incestual way, lust, greed. Conquest. It, 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 there is no romance involved. It's just sex, you know, on stage. Which, which it, I mean, we don't see that. Uh, it's, it's, you know, it's explicit. You know what, what it's talking about. And the play, when it was written in 1900, it was banned for many, many years, um, you know, because of its content. Both Augustine and Karen Kane, two of Canada's most renowned dancers, are especially arresting in their performance as the actress and the count. Bernardo Bertolucci's epic film, The Last Emperor, walked away with four Golden Globe Awards, including Best Film on Saturday. Other awards at the ceremony included Michael Douglas for Wall Street, Cher for Moonstruck, and L.A. Law for Best TV Drama. In trivia today, the question was, what was the name of the 1974 movie in which Faye Dunaway played femme fatale to Jack Nicholson's private eye? The answer is Chinatown. Faye's latest movie, Bar Fly, opens this Friday in Calgary. Join me tomorrow for more highlights from the Olympic Arts Festival on the Entertainment Report. I'm Jamie Wall.